Hi, this is Mark Cook from Motorcyclist Magazine at AIM Expo 2015 with Rick Racedonia from Senna. We're going to look at some new product here. you got some pretty revolutionary stuff for a communicator company. We really do. I think this is something that uh, one thing Senna is very well known for is looking outside the box. And with our new smart helmet, this is exactly what we've done. Uh, we've created a full helmet application called INC, Internal Noise Cancellation. So we've created the helmet itself, which is a uh, carbon fiber helmet, uh, but inside is really where the technology is. The INC is technology that is has external speakers that's going to allow the external noise to come into the helmet. The uh, noise will then be digitized and reduced uh, greatly by what you're already hearing, all of the ground noise, all of the external noises. Uh, right now you're getting at about 65 miles an hour. Uh, you get about 110 decibel. And at that range is where you can do a, a tremendous amount of air damage. With our system, we're gonna get that to be able to reduce down to about 65 decibel. In addition to this, we also have the Bluetooth add-on, whether it is of our uh, well, very well-known SMH10 product or our 20S product add-ons, which is a very simple clip-on type uh, process. The modu uh, modular pieces for the INC product, which is a trademark uh, uh, name, is merely the control unit itself, and then internally, we have the speaker assembly. Within this speaker assembly, of course, is the added padding for the ear itself. And then back here is where the speaker is. With this connection is where the external microphones are then bringing the noise into. And then it's being digitized inside and reducing the noise. It's pretty cool technology. It's been used in aviation and, of course, in, in consumer headphones. Yes. But this is the first I've, I've heard of for, an, for a motorcycle helmet. It, it, it absolutely is a, a first. And the kind of reaction that we've received so far uh, here at AIM Expo is nothing but spectacular. Well, one of the things I like about it, and you, we had a little product demo earlier, is all the wiring and all the all the all the integration is built into the helmet. Absolutely. There's no wires hanging. Uh, it's really, really nicely done, and includes a little remote on the side, and it's just it's very, very cleanly done. What we're offering here is uh, we have really actually two two systems: the helmet with the INC system which is already installed into the helmet. So that's basically one package. The next package is the Bluetooth module portion, which is simply two pieces. And the really nice thing is that the remote control is wireless to the brains of the intercom system. You can't get any simpler than this. This is one of many new products that Senna has here at the show. We're gonna take a look at a few more. So in addition to the INC, have some updates to some existing product yes. uh, and some new product as well. Take us quickly through that. First of all, what we're looking at here is the 10S, which is our next generation SMH10. We've done a streamlining to the actual product itself. We're using the 20S jog dial. Uh, what we've also done is to increase the uh, range of uh, the 10, and we've included FM radio. Uh, also, one of the big things is on the SMH10, we have a number of clamp systems. Depending on how you ride, whether you use earbuds or whatever the case is, we decided this time with the 10S, we're going to do a complete universal clamp system. The other upgrade is that we've gone to the 20S speakers. So this is a system that is really going to be exceptionally popular since the SMH10 was the most popular system we've ever had. All right, so you're populating out the line. Now one of my favorites is the, uh, the 10R. The 10R. I, I love the form factor of this, but you got a bunch of new, new features in this. We do. Uh, again, with the 10R, what this is, is an upgrade. We had a uh, longer range. We've included FM radio. Uh, but in the kit also now, because we've increased the Bluetooth chip from 3.0 to 4.0, we're now able to utilize our remote control. So instead of having to reach up to the helmet to use the, uh, the device on the helmet, 
literally you could be on your grip and you can control all of the aspects, all the features on the 10R. And that's going to be the same case for the 10S. Now I notice you got another one here too. This is a wrist strap. Yeah, this is really a departure here. This is something we took into consideration the passenger on this one. So literally, uh, this is a, the, basically the same principle as the remote control. So what the passenger does is will strap the wristband and then they're able to pair it to their headset and be able to control just sitting back using the joystick. That's just what I want, my passenger telling me what kind of music I can listen to. <laughs> I, I'm not sure I like that particular feature. So you got a bunch of new stuff. Uh, when is the helmet going to be available and when? Uh, how much will that cost? Uh, so we're looking at probably the fall of 2016. Uh, for the helmet. It's still very much in uh, prototype phase. We're expecting for the helmet with the INC system included maybe in the 600 range. As far as the additional Bluetooth modules, that could be anywhere from 150 to 250. We haven't narrowed that down yet. But it's we're expecting in from 8900 for the entire Cadillac. That's pretty nice. And all of these uh, uh, updated products are available now, correct? They are available now, yes. Well, that's a nice, uh, nice collection of features and some updates from Senna. I'm Mark Cook reporting from AIM Expo 2015.